What I wanted to ask is, where does the change happen in a person? When we give a person good examples and how to accept others, and we have meals together, we show good examples to each other, and he sees it and behaves that way, and he's appreciated for it. When or where or how does the inner change happen in him? Because he is impressed by the environment, he's inspired by it, and then he's included in the environment, and then the environment builds its system in him. That in him, there is this model of the environment that's made, that's created, and by that he feels the environment, meaning now he has something by which he feels the environment, something that a dog can't have. He can feel his master even, even the, his master's character. A cat can feel their, the mood of the people that are close to them and so on. But a human being builds inside himself a model of the environment and then through this model he relates to the environment and the environment starts living in him. And then that way there is an interaction made between him and the environment that a person has to feel the entire environment and that already begins to be life on the human level. How does that change his behavior? By being included in the environment, by feeling the environment that's inside of him, from this inner model of his, he relates to the model of the external environment. It's like sometimes we tell a person, don't you feel what he thinks or what they're doing? Don't you feel, meaning we're actually asking, you don't have this model of that person or the environment or the society that internally you don't understand, You're, you can't make the, the necessary preparation of how to come out to them, to talk to them, they are those that can't. They're deaf internally and they can't build inside themselves external models. And then that person is disconnected from his environment. He doesn't understand what's required of him. It's like a baby that still didn't build these kinds of systems inside of him. So he's looking, not understanding. What is he required to do? What does everyone want? And there are many such people. I'm saying that even most people live their life without the inner models of the universe, of society, of nations, of what is required, demanded of them. We don't teach them how to build this inner model. And this is the main kind of education that a person should have. And therefore, all the behaviors depend on the measure to which I, according to the models that I have, these inner templates of different societies, people, and so on, to the measure to which I correctly work with them, and then I realize in practice, I realize it in practice in my behavior toward the world. Dr. Leitman, I see that this entire world, unfortunately, our time's almost over. What's the main thing to take from this show? Behavior change is a result of what? Behavior change is a result of a person finding inside himself the correct model of the external society.